Um, okay. Are you ready? Just looking all braggedy all the time. When are you gonna shave your? <laughs> Can you stop doing that? <laughs> I don't mean fake it. Like just you're tired. I'm trying to get you to not be so tired. You're annoying. <laughs> well, yeah, what I do? I'm trying to move it over the side. Are you ready? I need you to make another beat for me, like a long. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Billionaire Mandy and it is my husband, Roger. Hello. Hi. Hi. <laughs> okay, so we did, hopefully, we're like working against the light right now. We're trying to, we like have a little bit of lighting left for the day, but we really wanted to shoot this video for you guys. Um, so we're gonna do the husband tag and I refined some of the questions to kind of like get you guys up to date. Um, anything you want to say before we start? Let's get it on. Okay. A lot of the questions we answered while he was my boyfriend in the boyfriend tag, and I'll go ahead and link that down below. Uh, so those questions I won't, like, re-answer unless they changed. First question, when did you know I was the one? Hmm. Uh, I would say the... Camera's up here. Oh, come on. Come on. Okay, go ahead, go ahead. Are you recording? I am recording. The first question is how did you know I was the one? Um I think that's when uh we had our first real conversation about where we wanna go, what's our plans and so on. Okay. Um, who said I love you first? Oh, that would be you. What? Yes. I did not say I love that you first. That is her. It was yeah, not, yeah, no, it yes, was. Yes, yes. Roger. Yes. I wasn't the one that said I love you first. You were the one that told me first. You said it first. No, I did not. She said it. Um, first impression. What was your first impression of me? Oh. Very uh, hot, <laughs> sexy. I was 15. He was a pervert. I don't know. <laughs> Come on. You were a very big 15. <laughs> My first impression of him was, what, first of all, like when we were younger, he never came up and actually spoke to me. He would always just stare. Like for a good two years, he would stare at me. So whenever we were like, in the company of our mutual friends or we go out together because we went to the same church roger would just stare at me so i would just be like why is he staring one and then once i got past the staring he has a part of his body that i absolutely love which is his bow leggedness that is so sexy and he has like a nice firm ass oh yeah so that kind of <laughs> That kind of had me first. Mm, she loves to pop it. Okay. Um, when did you meet the family? Well, I can say I told my mom about him on a... We went out on a... Uh, what is that? A Valentine's date, and I told her about him. Told him about... Told her about him. And that was when I was 16. So you. My parents knew from the first time they saw now my wife <laughs> you know they knew that something was going on so i had to come straight and let them know, you know that um i have an interest okay what's a weird habit that annoys you about me hmm. one or uh, two three. okay just say it just say it. what what annoys you about me um she could be a little bit uh, naggy. Okay. Yeah. <sighs> wow. Okay. One habit that annoys him about me. That annoys. That annoys me about him. 
Roger likes to procrastinate, so he'll have the opportunity to do something now, and he'll be like, oh, let's leave it for tomorrow, and when we get up or later tonight, and knowing that he's really not going to do it, he's just saying that to appease me. That absolutely annoys me that he does not seize the moment and take advantage of it. I thought so. That's good, that's good. Oh, when? Uh, what else? Um, how long have we been together? But we've been married for four years. I'm sorry, three years. <laughs> three years and what? September, October, November, December. Four months. Uh, we've been together for about... Seven. Seven years. So seven and three is ten. Mm-hmm. Ten years in total. Um, oop, my phone went off. Uh, do we have any traditions? Well, I would say one tradition that I really, really like. On Sunday afternoons, we did this even when we were courting um, as young teenagers. Um, Sunday afternoon after church, we would eat and then we would lay on the back step. That time, you could be outside. But now, we would lay on the back step and we would just talk. Like, we would just talk about any and everything. And now, as we're older and we have our own house and stuff... On Sunday afternoons, if we don't, you know, go out with friends, we will come home and just lay and just talk. So that's one tradition that we have that I really like. What's one tradition you like? Um, that's pretty much it. Uh, we kind of um, on the same page when it comes to our traditions. So. Yeah. Okay. How long have we? Oh, I had the one. First thing. What's the first thing you noticed about me when you saw me? Would that be the first time or? The fir- the very first time you laid eyes on me was the first thing you noticed. That you are a very much mature person in uh, everything you do because I've been looking at you for a while. Yeah, yeah you know. we know. You were stalking yeah. for a while. And I like, I really like uh, to see people act in a mature way so... That is the first thing that caught me besides the hot, sexy look. Yeah. At 15. Yeah, let's just <laughs> throw that in there. I was 15. God damn. <laughs> Don't have to say it, you know. Oh, well. Um, one thing that pisses me off about you. Mm-hmm. Let's hear it. Um, you tell me yours first. I no, you went. No, 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 no. You're not going to suck me into this. Oh, no. Hopefully there is nothing. Apart from what, apart, apart from his procrastination, I can't even say like, because I honestly expected him to be the man that leaves his clothes around, but he's not. Like he cleans up after himself. So that, you know, that's usually your go-to answer. That comes from um, good parenting, you know? Okay, good parenting. Mm-hmm. He does not leave his clothes around, which <laughs> makes my life so much easier. Mm-hmm. Um, what pisses me off about you? Not a thing. <laughs> no, I can't. Okay, wait. Um, he sh- Roger shuts down a lot. Not a lot, but let's say maybe he's disappointed in you know the way he acted or something he did or like if we got into an argument or whatever. Instead of being more verbal and communicating, he'll shut down first and then wait a day and then communicate. I mean, everybody processes things differently. But I just wish that that day doesn't have to pass before we can talk about things. Because I, honestly, I always think of, you know, what if he dies or I die, God forbid, or something happens and you didn't get to fix it. So I always prefer to fix things early. So, I, But I can't really think of anything else that pisses me off. What pisses you off about me? Um, let me see. Let me, yes, yes, yes. Let, let me see. Uh, I have a very long list. Okay. Um, hmm. Oh, you know, um, when you're asking for an advice on something and you're given it and then you don't take it, you go elsewhere and you ask for advice on the same thing and the person or persons outside gives you the exact advice I gave you and then you say okay well you will go with it okay 
We're not going to talk about that. When was the last time I did that? You asked the question. I answered the question. <laughs> you trying to be political. Mm. All right. All right, all right. Okay, next one. Favorite features about each other. Um, His ass. What his about the ass? It's just nice and firm and you have ass. Like, I'm supposed to be talking about your ass. I like a man with a little bit of buns. And uh, his bow leg. Roger just has so much swag, which is what like I was drawn to. Mm -hmm. He has so like he's quiet and very unassuming, but he has so much swag that it's like. Ooh. So my favorite feature would be, yeah, that. What's your favorite feature about me? Well, um, she's packing a lot, you know. Yes. Everything is nice and fluffy, you know. Yeah, that that same thing, you know what I mean? And um her butt is nice. Solid, you know. Mm, mm. <laughs> okay. Um three things uh I and I assume it was physical features. So the next question is three things that I'm good at and three things that I'm not good at. What are three things that I'm good at? Okay, um, one, cooking, baking. Oh yes, um, she's good at that. Um, what else? Um, doing hair. So if you need your hair done, I guess you get into co get in contact with her and she'll do it for you. Nice and easy. Uh, the third one is um, she loves to dress, and I know because she, she dresses me too, you know. So those are three of the many things that she can do good. Um, the ones that she can't really do well. Hmm. That's a tall order. Because you know I does it all, boo-boo. Honestly, um, I can't think of anything. Sorry. Okay. Um, three things that he's good at. <sighs> he irons really, really, really well. Like, Roger irons like a professional. He irons in places that I didn't even know you were supposed to iron. He irons really well. Um, he's very good with, like, organizing things and... I feel like the lifestyle that we have, he's adjusted really well. So he has, he's very supple in a way. Like he's able to adjust. You're just trying to get comfortable so you can be lazy. Oh yeah. He. I'm trying to focus on the camera. Here. Let me bring it down some. Okay. So he adjusts really well. And um, what's one other thing you're good at? He can't cook. That's one thing he's not good at. Can't cook. Can't cook can't cook um <laughs> but it doesn't matter because he cleans like when he cleans his house or our bedroom or whatever like it's cleaned so he cleans really well he irons really well the laundry's a little iffy but what <laughs> babe you ruined my expensive tahari dress you did not tell me it wasn't supposed to go in the dryer. You were supposed to read the sign. I didn't know either, but I'm still gonna blame you for that because I didn't do it. You see? But oh, and he's really handy. Like literally, he built all our wardrobes, our shelves, our shelving units, just everything in this room, everything in the house. Like he built. So he's very handy, and I really love that he's like construction savvy. Um, next question. Who wears the pants in this relationship? Oh, yes. Not a doubt about that. Who no? Who no wear the pants? Yeah. All right, so our relationship is very traditional. Roger is the head of the household. and Damn um, right. There you go. <laughs> and um, we decided the way we want it to be. When we got married, we decided, decided. Um, the type of life we wanted and... I definitely, I had a father figure in my life, 
for most of my life and I enjoyed it and I enjoy having that covering over me and having him you know be the head of our household and just be there spiritually my battery's dying okay next question um who do, do you have any weird obsessions do I have any weird obsessions here, here. lots of here okay uh do you have any weird obsessions oh yeah what the usual cards Cars and drawings and drawings. Okay. Um, nicknames. Uh, Do we have any nicknames? Nope. No. No. It's just babe or honey. Yeah. Favorite restaurants. Um, we haven't gotten out that much. Like literally, I cook everything we eat, so I can't really say they can hear that noise in the background. Thank you. Um, so we can't really say our favorite restaurant. Favorite TV shows that we love to watch. Hawaii Five O, Chicago PD. What else? NCIS. <laughs> mm hmm Pretty much. Like any of that type of shows we like watching. Um one thing one thing I don't like. One thing I well I said that before. Um, what drink do I order when we go out? Yeah, I always get like a martini or not a martini, um, I like sangrias, that type of stuff. Uh, Do you have any comments? Anything you want to say to my viewers? She put me up to this. She did. <sighs> yes, I did. Mm -hmm. I asked him before. He whined and he was like, I'm not in the mood and blah, blah, blah. I am not a, a camera person. Okay, yeah, he's more the behind the scenes. He builds my tracks and makes my music and that type of stuff. But it doesn't matter because a happy wife is a happy life. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So to do this, to make her happy, I'm happy. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Okay, so if you guys have any other questions, comments, or concerns, if you guys want us to do a round two or episode two where you have questions that you want us to ask, be sure to leave them down below and I'll make a note of them. And then we will do another video, won't we? Yes, we will. Yes. Mm, yeah. My head is moving. <laughs> yes. Okay, so bye guys. Bye-bye.